don't be trapped. I've noticed in my practice quite a lot recently that people have really had strong reactions to feeling trapped or being stuck in a situation they can't get out of. And I want to address this because it's very closely linked into tinnitus and the fight or flight response. If we're in a challenging situation that we want to get out of, or if there's danger or perceived threat, in the fight or flight response, where we flood with adrenaline, getting ready to either attack the lion or run away from it, it's really important not to feel trapped. So first thing, first things first is if you feel claustrophobic or you're putting up with a situation that is difficult, please, if you can, just get up and go. Most people will understand if you have to say, excuse me, I must just go to the loo or I just need to open a window. Probably best to get out, out of the situation. Especially if it involves loud sound or noise that you don't like <clears throat> or an argument where you're having negativity coming in through the auditory pathway. Um, you know, if you're not comfortable in a loud environment or an unpleasant sound experience emotionally or for whatever reason or if you're feeling uncomfortable <clears throat> at home in peace and quiet when you've been used to lots of noise and hubbub I really recommend that you instead of feeling trapped with this get up and go get out let your legs carry you away psychologically this is going to make you feel much more empowered your body is going to be getting ready for action so actually allowing the adrenaline to get your legs to carry them uh, carry you away with them is actually what the body is trying to do and often when we step out run out go for a run get away go for a walk around the block <clears throat> that energy really pushes us into escape mode and walking around the block for five minutes, walking through a forest, getting away from an argument, actually allows this fight or flight response to start calming down. So for goodness sake, please don't be trapped. <clears throat> don't stay stuck in a situation that's difficult in a family dynamic or in a concert or in a place that you feel a bit uncomfortable, I really would recommend getting up, going for a walk, and by the time you come back, you're probably gonna feel much, much safer because you know you can escape, and that coming back, you know you can still get out and go for a walk, but very likely the active alert that or the adrenal response will have settled quite a lot by the time you come back. And the more you can settle, the better for tinnitus or for any stress response, to be honest. So um, if you are in a situation where you're being polite because of so social conventions, we're very good at doing what we're told um, when our body is really saying, get the hell out of here. <laughs> um, do try and work with the body, do escape, get out, give it its freedom, take space, take some fresh air, really breathe into the big space outside. And then when you come back, you'll probably feel much, much better. I've noticed with tinnitus, it's particularly useful to allow yourself to get out of difficult situations. And this is loud concerts, living with bullies, um, being in uncomfortable situations, um, interacting with awkward people. Don't be shy about saying, excuse me, I must just pop to the loo or listen, can we talk about this another time? I've got to go to the shops or whatever it is. Get out, get away. And then when you come back, you're going to feel much, much better. This is incredibly helpful for the fight or flight response. Take flight. Don't feel trapped. This will help you.